he led by example. Uh, he didn't have to say anything to the lads because they all knew that Morrow would turn in an immaculate performance. Mm. And you just try to match that all the time. Uh, throughout the World Cup, when I got injured and uh, Jeff, Jeff came in, uh, and I knew I'd be out from then on once Jeff scored the goal against Argentina. It was all over for me. I knew that. Unless somebody else got injured, mm. uh, I was never going to get my place back. And we, we stayed good friends, um, Bob and I, throughout that. I mean, nobody, it's, it's an interesting thing. When, when you're in a squad together like that, people don't mention injuries or, or being dropped. It's something personal between the player and the manager, really. And most of it's avoided. Uh, and, and that's how it was. Um, and I knew then that... Uh, with with Jeff coming in and scoring the goal, my only way back yes. was was uh, was through somebody else getting injured because there was no subs in those days, no. as we all no. know. But Bob, uh, after I mean, Bobby took it all as a matter of course. You know, he he was he never really ever got excited. Uh, I think when he lifted the cup, uh, we saw his face and the great emotion of it all, but he was probably still the calmest bloke in, in the stadium.